First and foremost, the question is, how do you feel you performed in today's workout, and how does this workout differentiate from uh, some of the others you've been at? Uh, I think I did pretty well to, to finish it off. I started off a little slow, but I, mean, I did, did pretty well at the end of it. So, I mean, I, overall, I think it was a pretty good workout, but I mean, I haven't been in very many workouts, but I mean, it was definitely up there. I mean, it's, it was very physical today. I mean, uh, Jalen from uh, Xavier, he, uh, he's a big guy, so I mean, it kind of hit me there at the beginning of it, and I had to readjust my thinking there. So, I mean, that was just the biggest thing for me. And, I mean, but other than that, it was a really good workout. Is that going to be one of the challenges for you, too, the size of the NBA, and how are you trying to prepare yourself for that? Uh, I don't think it'll be a challenge. I mean, it is going to be a challenge for me, but I can, when I, whatever team decides to pick me, I know they'll be able to get me stronger and be able to add a little weight to my body and stuff. So, I mean, I'm not really worried about it too much. It's just I got to get there and just work extremely hard to get my body prepared for training camp and then right through training camp and just get ready for the season because I know that hopefully I can go in there and be able to produce as soon as I get in there and be able to help a team out. I know players focus on improving themselves during the summer, but this is a different summer because you're going from college to the NBA. So what have you placed the emphasis on this summer in terms of both physically and basketball on-court-wise? Uh, physically, I mean, just trying to be in the best shape of my life so I can be able to keep up with these guys and just be able to keep going and not give up in, in these workouts. And then just on the court, just being able to uh, step out and step away from the block because, I mean, in college I was more of a back-to-the-back -back type of player. And uh, in our system, that was the way that we want, they want us to play. And, just being able to go out there and be able to show them that I can shoot the ball, that's the biggest thing for me right now. Coming off of four years at a high-level program, do you look at a team like the Raptors that, you know, they're coming off a deep playoff run, do you see that as making you a fit with a team like this? Oh, yeah, I can definitely feel with a team like this. I mean, those guys, did a, they had a fantastic year, and, I mean, they, they really did some great things. I mean, I can definitely come in here and help them get over that hump again if they, if they need me to. It's just if they want, to, want me here, then I'll be ready to come out here and be able to do those types of things. Um, we did a poll on the, the site that I write for, and over 2,000 people voted with the number 27 pick. You were the most popular pick that Raptors fans wanted at, at number 27. Is, is that something that registers to you at all or means anything to you? No, no, I'm just, I'm out here trying to just, I'm out here auditioning for a job. So if, if they decide to pick me, then hey, I, I'll be thankful for the opportunity. I mean, I, I do know that a lot of guys want this opportunity and they don't get the chance to do it. So I mean, I'm not going to be like, oh, I want to go here, I want to go there. I mean, I'm going to be humble about it and be like, hey, I mean, that's where I'm going to go. I'll go there.